Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Leo September 8, 2022. Venus in this area of your solar chart helps smooth over your reputation, and it could point to more enjoyment of your career, connections, or duties. You're appreciated for your interactions, cooperation, art, or charming approach. It's a good influence for your public image, reputation, and professional endeavors. You could be negotiating with more ease or catching some breaks. Today's energies are more complicated, making it difficult to be objective. Insecurities threaten to skew your view. As the planets move through the sky, they activate different frequencies and energies for you. Sweet Venus, our goddess planet of romance, pleasure, and joy, will be moving today into your solar 10th house. On one hand, this will turn your attention away from your personal and romantic life to your professional one. But the best way to harness this energy is to be sure to give time, service, and gifts to the one who your heart adores. They will resonate with it and be especially supportive of you as you continue to reach to your greatest ambitions. What do you want to be known for? One of your commitments or relationships may shape the details of your professional status as Venus enters Virgo today. Although you are an expansive, professional thrill-seeker, there are still others who play a part in your success. Venus in Virgo encourages you to align your reputation and accomplishments with the commitments that will serve you in the long run. Some of your bonds, partnerships, or achievements will play a crucial role in defining your career. Make sure you choose wisely with scrutinous Venus in Virgo on your side. The moon's monthly visit to your income sector is something that can always sharpen your nose for money and act as a trigger but the timing takes this to a whole new level. As well as having the moon here during Venus, the planet of money's first full day in your career sector this is creating a lot of positive energy across the income, work and career fronts in the heart of the working week. Better still, this is just a taste of things to come. Today offers a good opportunity to rein in your desire to look for satisfaction elsewhere. Try aiming to be satisfied with your own body. This could take work in many areas of your life, not just diet and exercise. But acceptance of your own body is a lifelong issue, and you will serve yourself well if you can open up to what you truly feel about it. The day's planetary aspect will help you see the truth beneath the protective shell of denial. Sentimentally, today's vibrations could provoke some instability or a sensation of dissatisfaction. You may feel new desires emerging in your love life. Do you have some fantasies that are demanding to be realized? If this is the case, don't be too impatient. Start by being communicative because this is probably the best means of getting what you want. The Moon and Venus are still closely aligned even after their friendly aspect yesterday. Both have moved on but just having the moon in your income sector during Venus' first full day in your career sector is giving the planet of money a head start. This is also putting the sun and moon in harmony days before they are due to clash later in the week, as a full moon. For now, this is putting things in harmony across the income, work and career fronts as you move into the new working week. Venus. The planet of love may have left an adventurous part of your chart yesterday but her mission to bring the spirit of romance and adventure together is not only in safe hands but has a lasting legacy. The Dwarf Planet series will stay on in an adventurous part of your chart until the end of the month but the planets on the romantic front are here for the rest of the year. Our Eyes in the Sky The Capricorn Moon has a rocky journey this morning forming squares with Jupiter and Mercury. People are likely to be more self-absorbed than usual, and it might be difficult to find comfort when needed. The moon can bring deep thoughts to the forefront of the mind. Unfortunately, you aren't immune to this, and you might find your mind swimming in some gloomy waters. Jupiter only increases this. When Jupiter enters the mix, you could feel anxiety around your responsibilities and your ability to accomplish your goals. If you let it, self-doubt could get the better of you. The vibe is heavy, and we might find that the people we encounter are in bad moods as well. It will help to remember that we're all attempting to navigate this energy, so try to lead by example and be kind to others. 
Mercury can offer some relief if we can find a way to lean into our optimism, especially when it comes to dreams and fantasies. The moon trines Uranus this morning, putting us in touch with our individuality and need for personal freedom. Be sure to honor your truest and freest self. This energy allows you to grow and become the person you want to be. Trust the process as you transform and change with the lunar energy. As nightfall nears, the moon calms down, giving us plenty of energy to work toward our dreams. However, a square with Chiron could make it difficult for you to find balance, and you might have trouble falling asleep. Don't be afraid to give yourself a break. In the pre-dawn hours, the Capricorn moon trines Uranus in Taurus, provoking excitement. This electric influence arouses our interest in the serendipitous and strange. As many of us will be asleep at this hour, our dreams may be filled with inspirational ideas. We might even receive the blueprint for an innovative plan that we can put into practice upon waking. Many of the world's so-called geniuses have claimed to have obtained their most profound ideas through dreams. Tonight may offer us our own Eureka. Moment. Around dawn, Ceres opposes Saturn in Aquarius, making it difficult to offer or receive support. Ceres in Leo wishes to pamper and praise the inner child. It nurtures by bolstering our self-esteem. Saturn, on the other hand, is a stricter taskmaster. It is not the kind to hand out participation trophies. It wants us to work for our medals. As these two objects oppose, we become unsure of ourselves. Try to have practical expectations to avoid becoming disheartened. A balance must be struck between maturity and warmth. Allowing ourselves to be vulnerable will help us achieve an anchoring kind of inner strength. The moon's aspect with Neptune allows our hearts to be filled with warmth and pride, so don't be afraid to give and receive love over the next few weeks. The Pluto energy allows us to see people's true intentions, which could be disappointing or maddening. There could be some conflict. Trust your intuition so you can understand the true motives of others. The energy could threaten to throw off your chill vibe, so avoid petty gossip and try not to let mental chatter pull you away from a good thing. With all the day's frenetic energy, it would be a good idea to treat yourself to some delicious food and perhaps a nice bubble bath tonight. 